Over the past few years, I've learned that just when I think I've got turkey hunting all figured out, they remind me just how little I actually know. After 15 days of hard hunting and time running out, I decided just to leave the camera in the truck and enjoy one of my last mornings in the turkey woods for the 2020 season. With just a shotgun and a mouth call, I climbed the ridge one more time in hopes that maybe today was my lucky day. Well guys, as you can see, I had a pretty daggone good hunt this morning. Unfortunately, I didn't get any of it on video because I didn't even take the camera with me. You know, these past couple weeks have just been such a struggle. I haven't heard any birds, I haven't been able to get on any birds. So I just decided this morning that I wasn't taking the camera. And it was one of those hunts where I really wish I would have. You know, I, I got set up on that roost this morning where um, I've had some luck in the, you know, the past couple years and about 520 I heard this guy spit you know that and he was up there strutting on the limb and about quarter till six he gobbled about blew my hat off he was 38 yards from me on the limb and he proceeded to gobble 200 times I bet just every noise he gobbled at and uh, you know I kind of turned my head away from me did a couple real light tree yelps just as light as I could possibly do it and he hammered right back at it so I just shut up at that point and uh, luckily he was facing my direction. He flew down, landed 25 yards away, and pretty much walked right down the gun barrel. And I shot him at 20 yards with the 20 gauge and uh, just absolutely hammered him. But an awesome way to end the West Virginia turkey season. It's been a couple years since I've tagged out on birds, so it feels pretty good to uh, put number two down for the year. And uh, you know, it was exciting, a good hunt and now it's time to move on to deer season. But you know, the bike has been, you know, such a huge help this year. The first bird, you know, I was set up where this guy was this morning and I heard that bird in another area and I was able to make a real fast move and get on him and kill him right after fly down. And then this morning, you know, I climbed a 300 foot ridge in just a couple minutes. You know, anytime you can climb a 300 foot ridge straight up and not be out of breath is, is very nice, so. <laughs> but it was a good hunt. Um, wouldn't have ended it any other way. So thanks for tagging along this year. Sorry that the video wasn't better this year. That's just, that's hunting, that's how it goes. And you know, sometimes you just gotta put the camera away and just make things happen. And that's what I did this morning. But uh, it was a fun hunt and kind of bittersweet that turkey season's over for me. The more I chase these things, um, the more I love it. And uh, you know, they'll humble you. They're definitely a challenge to hunt. But when it all comes together, it's, uh, it's definitely something special.